हेलो एवरी वन इन्फॉर्मेशन बॉक्स टिकट लाइफ स्टाइल ब्रिंग्स यू एन ऑटमी एंड फिजियोलॉजी लेसन दिस इज द कंटिन्यूजेशन ऑफ यूनिट वन द बॉडी एज अ होल फर्स्ट वी विल लर्न अबाउट द ऑर्गेनाइजेशन ऑफ द बॉडी करेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ लाइफ एनाटमी एंड फिजियोलॉजी आर इम्पॉर्टेंट डिसिप्लिन इन बायोलॉजी द स्टडी ऑफ लाइफ बट वॉट इज लाइफ वॉट इज द क्वालिटी डेट डिस्टिंग्विश इज अ वाइटल एंड फंक्शनल बींग फ्रॉम अ डिसीज बॉडी वी नो दैट अ लिविंग ऑर्गेनिजम इज इन डॉवर्ड विद सर्टन करेक्टरिस्टिक्स नॉट एसोसिएटेड विद इन ऑर्गेनिक मैटर एवर देर इज नो शॉर्ट एंड वेरी स्पेसिफिक डेफिनेशन ऑफ लाइफ बिकॉज नो सिंगल क्राइटेरिया एडिक्वेंटली डिस्क्राइब्स लाइफ इंस्टेड ऑफ अ सिंगल डिफरेंस डेट सेपरेट्स लिविंग एंड नॉन लिविंग थिंग्स साइंटिस्ट मोस्ट फ्रिक्वेंटली डिफाइन लाइफ बाय अ लिस्टिंग ऑफ एट्रीब्यूट्स डेट टेकन टूगेदर आर ऑफन कॉल्ड करेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ लाइफ काइंडली डोंट फोरगेट टू लाइक दिस वीडियो सब्सक्राइब टू माई चैनल एंड प्रेस द बेल आइकन बटन सो यू डोंट मिस एनी ऑफ माई वीडियोज अ लिस्टिंग ऑफ करेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ लाइफ साइटेड बाई फिजोलॉजिस्ट मे डिफर depending on the type of organism being studied and the way in which life functions are grouped and defined attributes that characterize life in bacteria plants or animals may vary those that are considered most important in human lives are described as follow responsiveness responsiveness or irritability is that characteristic of life that permits an organism to sense monitor and respond to changes in its external environment withdrawing from a painful stimulus such as a pin prick is an example of responsiveness conductivity Conductivity refers to the capacity of living cells and tissues to selectively transmit or propagate a wave of excitation from one point to another within the body. Responsiveness and conductivity are highly developed in both nerve and muscle cells in living organisms. Growth Growth occurs as a result of a normal increase in size or number of cells. In most instances it produces an increase in the size of an individual or a particular organ or part but little change in the shape of the organism as a whole or of a part affected respiration respiration involves those processes that result in absorption transport utilization or exchange of respiratory gases such as oxygen and carbon dioxide between an organism and its environment the exchange of gases may occur between the blood and individual body cells which is internal respiration as the cells utilize nutrients to produce energy or between the blood and air in the lungs which is an external respiration kindly show your support by subscribing to my channel so that i can make more videos for you digestion digestion is a process by which complex food products are broken down into simpler substances that can be absorbed and used by individual body cells absorption absorption refers to the movement of digested nutrients through the walls of digestive tube and into the body fluids for transport to cells for use secretion secretion is the production and delivery of specialized substances such as digestive juices and hormones for diverse body functions excretion excretion refers to removal of waste products produced during many body functions including the breakdown and use of nutrients in the cell carbon dioxide is a gaseous waste that is excreted during respiration circulation circulation refers to the movement of body fluids and many other substances such as nutrients hormones and waste products from one body area to another reproduction 
Reproduction involves the formation of new individual and also the formation of new cells with the help of cell division in the body to permit growth, wound repair and replacement of that or aging cells on a regular basis. Each characteristic of life is related to some total of all physical and chemical reaction occurring in the body. The term metabolism is used to describe these various processes. They include the steps involved in the breakdown of nutrient material to produce energy and the transformation of one material to another. For example, if we eat and absorb more sugar than needed for the body's immediate energy requirements, it is converted into an alternative form such as fat that can be stored in the body. Metabolic reactions are also required for making complex compounds out of simpler ones, as in tissue growth, wound repair or manufacture of body secretions. Each characteristic of life, its functional manifestation in the body, its integration with other body functions and structures, and its mechanism of control will be subject of study in the next video. So at the end of this video, I would like to give you a self-check. Number 1. List the characteristics of life in humans. Number 2. Define the term metabolism as it applies to the characteristics of life. Thank you so much for watching this channel. Stay tuned for more videos in the upcoming week. Thank you so much.